Hi guys, this is Melon and I was requested a video from James, oh shoot, Ve Veach? I don't know how to say his last name, but so basically it's about him being a bad roommate. I don't, I don't know too much about it, but um, it sounds fun. I don't know this guy. I don't know who he is. Um, I'm being introduced to so many comedians through this channel, so it's kind of fun to watch. In college, I dormed um, three different roommates actually for different reasons. None were too horrible. Um, I will say I didn't know them all. So I would never just like room with a random roommate. Uh, so me knowing all of them, yeah, I didn't have too bad of an experience, but I've had things that did piss me off. So I'm, I'm excited to see this. So yeah, I'm just gonna go for it. I, uh, I got into quite a bit of trouble recently um, with my, uh, my flatmate. Do you, you, the, how do you call them flatmates here? Do you call them uh, roommates, roommates, right? Roommates, yeah. Yeah, okay, so I got in trouble with, with well, she messaged me and she said, James, um, would you mind uh, taking your clothes that are drying in the bathroom and moving them into your bedroom? Uh, take your clothes that are drying in the bathroom, move into your bedroom because my mum's coming over. She hasn't met you before. Uh, she hasn't seen the place we live before. I want to make a good impression. So I did that. Okay. I took all my clothes that are drying in the bathroom and I put them uh, in, in my bedroom. And uh, they were still a bit wet as well, so hero. But then it transpires, guys. All you need is like, what is that? Like one, two, three, four, five, six bags of flour and like an afternoon and a little bit of creativity. And you, you could pretty much make yourself like a full-on kind of drugs, um, I would say, sort of... In, 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 in the house and then obviously you, you know you, you don't want to just you know you keep you have to obviously be a little bit creative and then Why? I found a do, I, you know a do, a, and then I thought I thought and then obviously you know I thought it was a bit subtle so then what I did is I, I had like a, a obviously a tick book you know like people owe me money uh, you know, for drugs uh, and then I sold them and then and then you know that was I mean I'll be honest you you have already enjoyed that far more than she did yeah oh I'm sure but the thing is, is that I don't know where, to, I don't know where the line, I don't know where to like stop. You know what I mean? I, basically, that was just a precursor to what happened next, which is when I first moved in there to like shared accommodation, uh, they, they took, I had a big meeting with all the housemates and we sat around and they told me all the rules and stuff. And then they said, look, James, we've got these little boxes that we got from Ikea that we keep our toiletries in mm -hmm. and we've cleared one out for you. And I was like, hooray. <laughs> but I don't have any toiletries. So what I ended up doing was just basically, I just, I just filled mine with basically as many as I could. <laughs> I thought that was very funny. And then, and then every, the problem is every time I went in there, I would start to kind of like rearrange them. Do you know what I mean? I was having a great time. And then, and then this is genuinely happened. And then, and then, you know, one day I got like narrative, you know, I got more like a chase scene was kind of, you know, happening. And then after like four to five months, they started to develop their own kind of, you know, religion based around the kind of different, different kind of aspects of the, of the kind of, you know, and then they, honestly, it was beautiful. They had a, they had a wedding. That was such, honestly, that was such a beautiful day. That we were so lucky with the weather. Awesome. Wanted to it was really, it was really beautiful. And then uh, you, you, Halloween. Um, <laughs> Come on, you're gonna tell me he definitely just like f literally just took pictures of this literally like today, like right before the shoot, like maybe a day before, and just like did all this to prepare. It's so funny just thinking about it. From, like from six to eight months down the line, they genuinely started to get very sophisticated. They started to develop their own kind of culture, like entertainment. They started to make their own kind of movies. They, they had a few blockbusters. This was, this was beautiful. It was like, it was all, do you know what I mean? It was a really lovely, it was a lovely moment. It was, <laughs> generating from the, from the drain. <laughs> you know I mean? And then the problem is, I don't know if you know this, guys, but if you, if you go online, right, if you, if, if you go online, you can actually, you can get these, like, you can, you can buy these wholesale oh, uh, from China. This generally happens. This is, uh, oh, my. I just, I'm not time. Like, what I do is I stay to Nuremberg in the bath. This got me to see people in trouble. This was not good. <laughs> That's not a message anyone wants to get. Do you know what I mean? And I, I, I was like, the duck is always be denying the duck. I was just denying the duck. <laughs> she was at the bathroom duck. So I was like, I was at the bathroom duck. She said, what? The bathroom. I was like, oh, the, those ducks. <laughs> what about them? She said, please stop. <laughs> I was in a rush this morning, but I couldn't shower until I'd moved like a hundred <laughs> tiny ducks. 
And I said, okay, sorry about that. From now on, no more tiny ducks. Oh, yeah? Oh, God, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'll, I'll be honest, some of you have spotted that loophole far quicker than she has. <laughs> She, she, did, she genuinely, she did not see this coming. This hit like <gasps> bricks. I was not, you know. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, kind of. <laughs> she said, I'm away this weekend. By the time I get back, I want all ducks. I mean, to be fair to her, it was getting quite hard to move around the flat. There were, there were a significant number of ducks. <laughs> and I said, look, can I have one duck in the bathroom? Oh, my gosh, I'm scared. And she said, one. Oh, no. It's going to be like an inflatable duck that, you, that fits the whole entire bathroom. That's my, I don't know, my prediction. gag gifts because listen there's some actual terrible roommates like he's not even that bad at all he was he was just having some fun if anything except except the the first part with the cocaine or the, the flower um <laughs> or whatever um if my parents came and um saw something like that <laughs> i'd be moving out like i think one time for an april fool's joke like i just got a bunch of balloons and i put it in my roommate's room it was kind of fun um but yeah and we ended up just having a good time like brought it to the living room so it was cool i like pranks if they're lighthearted like this like like the, the duck one um just like fun <laughs> overall um but i'm not a big prank person overall really fun i'm really glad somebody requested this video it was really fun um so yeah let me know what else you want to see from me i will look at your requests and i will possibly react to them in the future so if you enjoyed this video please like it i would really appreciate that subscribe to see more of my reactions and thank you so much for watching and i hope you enjoyed Don't wanna sleep in, cause I got something to prove I gotta take what I hate and finally make a move I think of you and all the shit you don't do